Shopify world. So my name is Andrew from ecommerceexperts.io and welcome to another Shopify app review. So um, this week we are going to look at custom fields. We did a whole series about meta fields apps uh, that you can check out. We'll put the links everywhere. And so um, this week we're going to look at the custom fields meta fields app because some of the apps were lacking things. You guys reached out to us, and you know, like you know, we have problems installing the code. Uh, they're not the most user friendly apps. Uh, meta fields, meta fields are kind of a complicated subject, but very important for a nice Shopify store. So um, that's why this week we are checking out one of the last ones of our series, custom fields uh, meta fields app, and uh, let's check it out. Remember to like, subscribe if you're new to our channel uh, let us know that we are actually doing something that you like if not comment on how we can do it better and uh, see you on the other side guys cheers all right start with the installation from Shopify App Store uh, the app has 27 reviews with a 4.9 out of 5 dang son uh, on their website, they are stating that custom fields is the most advanced meta field editor available for Shopify uh, it's extensive, flexible, and smart, and we will see about that in just a second. Give the necessary permission to the app and you are good to go. Once these steps are done, you will be greeted with the first look nice design. In the left menu, you can navigate from Get Started, Product, Pages, Blog Posts, Collections, Orders, Customers, and Globals and Settings, and just Settings. Each one expands with a drop-down menu with some additional options. On the Get Started tab, you can find some helpful information about the app and also video tutorials. All right, there are pretty straight to the point tutorials since they are all less than three minutes long, but it's a very nice touch. On their website, they advertise that you can add every imaginable field type from rich text to references if you install their Chrome plugin. You can manage your data right into the Shopify forms, easy import and filtered exports integrates Shopify bulk editor, you can edit any existing meta field, even if it was created with a different app. That sounds really exciting. So let's start with adding a meta fields to products. Hover the mouse over products and choose add fields. A new window appeared for custom field creation. First we have a field name. We will go with shipping details. Uh, machine name is automatically generated, which is a big plus for us. Now we need to choose between different field types. On a free plan, you can choose between text, text list, number, number list, integer, and checkbox. Um, that, that's pretty fair. If you're on a paid member, you can pick from a range of different fields, uh, including HTML, date, email, phone, URL, link, embedded code, liquid template, file upload, references, and groups. Since we are trying our best to only review free apps, we're going to choose basic text. We are going to skip next steps since they are not important for us now. Click on the blue button that says create a new text field. And after you save your new field, you will see a drop down called edit code. This is where you can edit the specific field's code and how it functions if you wish. We don't want to do that right now. Uh, the next step is pretty exciting. Click on the installation button under the products tab on the sidebar. Then select install custom fields for products. If you get this message, great news, custom field is already installed, you are good to go. This will automatically add the code necessary for the app to show your fields. Um, that's pretty awesome. It means you don't have to go and run around in your code anymore. Let's click on search and search for a product that we are going to test this app with. Click on edit custom fields on the right and let's write standard shipping. This should be it. Let's look at how it looks on our website. Here it is right under the product's description, and that was super easy. I mean, guys, this app can be a lifesaver if you want to add some extra fields under product descriptions. The install function makes it a lot better than all the other apps, in our opinion. Now, the free plan is fair, and if you need more options, paid plans are great. Also, import, export, and bulk edit on some objects can save you a lot of time. 
So we promise to be honest to give you the best chance to identify which app will fit best in your specific situation. In this specific situation, while it's very easy to install um, the meta field fields, it's pretty hard if you want your custom fields anywhere else beside under the description. Uh, if you want to move the custom field somewhere else around, uh, you will have to go into the team and into the, the code in a much more elaborate way, in our opinion, than the other apps. So that is something to keep in mind. But if you just want the custom fields under your description, then this is really a fantastic app. All right, that is it for today, people. I hope you liked our videos. If you did, again, please like, subscribe. This is really important for us. Uh, if you have anything else to ask, please don't hesitate in the comments. We reply to all of our comments. Uh, or you can just send us an email for our information, info at ecomexperts.io. And uh, that's also if you need any development work on your uh, Shopify site or any advice of any kind, we're more than happy to help. Uh, you can follow us on social media, on social media like i said we put bite-sized information that you can only title read so you're always up to date with the latest shopify news um, that you always know if they did something different in the product section or if they have a new api that can help you out or anything uh, that can help you sell more so for that follow either our linkedin page or shop or our facebook page ecomexperts.io we'll link to them and thank you so much for your support and we'll see you in another shopify app a review video. Bye.